Pronghorn just came back into the shop. Um, and I'm going to tell you a little bit about the spicy jam. So stay tuned for this video. Thanks. Hey everybody, how you doing? It's Trent Austin from Austin Custom Brass. Thanks so much for your great support. And yes, this is the first official video I think we um, have done since our 10,000 subscription level here on YouTube. So thanks so much for all your awesome support of the shop. Uh, if you haven't seen that concert, we uh, presented a free concert on Sunday. We premiered it uh, just as a thanks. And there's more concerts coming and many more mini lessons in the queue. So if you're not subscribed, hit that subscribe button and stay up to date with us. This horn is so much fun and it's so easy to play. I don't know if you've heard just how easy this horn was. This is uh, made by my, my main man, Mike Del Quadro in uh, Vegas. This is the Del Quadro Grizzly model is the base model, but it's also a, it's a hybrid. It's um, the Grizzly component with the bell and the valve block. And then he uses his spicy jam reverse lead pipe. And it's kind of super cool because it's like a, a, a sleeved lead pipe. So the result is a very, very smooth, easy, efficient playing horn. This horn is so much fun to play. And not to be just left without any other cool features, it also has this very beautiful um, shepherd's crook um, that he did by hand. Um, Get, of course, if you don't know Mike's horns, they are incredible. Uh, people like Kenny Rampton uh, play the horns. They're really beautiful horns. He uses the um, fantastic gets and valve block on it. So you have these great valves. And also, in this case, on this horn, you have the great finger buttons there as well. He has these really beautiful large rings that, that are scalloped on the inside. It's like these little attention, these things that you that you notice. Uh, in terms of the attention to detail, that's like the most comfortable finger ring I've ever ever experienced on an instrument. And it's just that little attention to detail that I think is really why Mike's horns are so fantastic. This horn plays just great. So I'm using my Mount Vernon 3C on this. I'm going to switch my mic and do a couple things on it. First, I'll do a little uh, Charlier. Brain errors are not included with the instrument, of course. But the reverse lead pipe is, is great because it feels so free. It's like the, the horn has such wiggle room in terms of where the slot goes. So check out some bending on this.
So while he has good wiggle room in the centers, it's still pretty efficient. I'll just do some arpeggios now. I missed the first high C, but the double C is fine. Um, it's just one of those days. Uh, playing jazz on this, as you heard at the beginning, is just so much fun. So let me, I'm going to play, uh, hmm. I'll play Stardust. It's one of my favorite tunes. Super fun, it really. It's it's almost like you're riding on rails with this horn. It's like vroom, you know where the horn is gonna go. At least when my brain gets engaged. And lastly, let's play some some. Uh, well, if I play it with a FX mouthpiece, which is that deep FX mouthpiece, I'm just gonna do a quick one on this. Um, and this was unscrewed, so that was narrowing a little bit. Hold on, there we go. Um, you'll hear it beautiful creaminess on this and the microphone i'm using is not my high high-end microphone and it's completely raw unedited unedited so But you're probably saying in your head, you call it a spicy jam. So let's let's give it some spice here. So I'm going to put a, a more commercial mouthpiece in and play some some high notes. Like I said before, the double Z on this horn is it's got a really nice slot, so you can 
just sit on it. You don't have to like really work at it. So this is an awesome horn. I'm almost tempted to keep it, but my collection is full at the moment. So grab the spicy jam today while you're um, hanging out. Hit that subscribe button and stay up to date with us. Thanks so much for your awesome support of ACD. I hope you all have an awesome day. Cheers.